Good evening, my lovely connoisseurs of the culture. My name is V, aka Vitamin DGR. Yes, I said good evening, because right now, in game, it is evening, as you could kind of more or less see. But nonetheless, I hope everyone's doing well this lovely night slash day. I'm switching the order around. Welcome back to Tokyo Xanadu EX. Oh boy, this this chapter. There's so, so much that's going down, but let me pause before I get further with this one. Um, last episode, we were able to actually get both, uh, I was about to say the Chief, I'm thinking of a completely different game. Um, we were able to get both, uh, Shio and Goro-sensei to join us, and we were able to, well, well, Exorcise returned. We managed to beat all the three little pillars, and to show you, because I am a man of my word, I still don't know what the heck that is. I'm a man of my word, I was able to go back, get an S rank, so as you can easily see, I have gotten so far... An S rank in every single thing because I don't know better. Or I'm stubborn. Or I'm completionist. I don't know. Any of the answers you want to say crazy, I I'll take all you got. But nonetheless, I don't think there's anything left for us but to go to the final dungeon. Which, well, okay, there is one leg left. Uh, before we go to bed, we need to go talk to apparently everyone. And then once we're done, head to the gym, which I don't know why... Uh, I st I'm sorry, I'm still thinking about who that question mark is, because I don't know whose icon that is. I was thinking about it between this and last episode, but it the only thing I think of is maybe Shiori, but I don't think that Shiori's silhouette, or maybe I just have bad vision, I don't know. But regardless, we're going to go talk to all our friends. I don't know why Rion and June we can't seem to have a moment with, because unlike anybody else, those two don't have exclamation marks. So there's that. Oh, and Ryota as well. But yeah, considering that this is the final, I guess, moment before we go into the final dungeon, then I guess it makes sense why everything's all quiet and I don't want to say soothing, but eh, so. Welcome, welcome, Puzzles, jumping in the stream saying, it's been a minute, can't believe Tokyo Xandu's still going on. Oh yeah, it's probably been, actually, it's still not my longest series, fun fact. But this is the, yes, this is the end game. This is the last calm moment before we go to the final dungeon. I still don't know if it's worth going to New Game Plus. I don't think I'm going to, but if there's enough uh, inclination, I might. But for the sake of things, yeah, this is pretty much how it's going to be. And I have no clue how emotional things are going to get, but I don't know. I'm just going to jump right into it before we go and uh, embracing the Tower of Despair. So, all right, everyone, let's get our tissues because there's probably going to be one moment that's going to make us cry. And I'm assuming that since this is the last moment before the final dungeon, there's going to be at least one character or so that's going to really get to me, right? So, all right, I got nothing left. Let's just get to it. If you like what you're about to hear and see and witness and all the others, then by all means, please follow me on Twitch with the handle of Vitamin DGR. After all, you're going to do it because I have the lovely voice you can't forget. All of you guys are like, wow, is that really his voice? Of course I have to support him. Or you can support me on YouTube with the same name and handle. I Jokes aside, I'm very grateful for all your support. And I'm grateful for you guys joining with me through this ride. It's been really fun. And I do like this game. It's, I don't know. It's just kind of like a hidden gem to me. But, alright. Where do we start? Um, we need to talk to all our friends. So I guess we'll just walk around and uh, get ready for this. Because I have no clue who's where. Starting with Toa, I suppose. Uh, welcome, uh, Puzzle says, uh, and Puzzle the chat says, join us on Discord, which you can find a link in the description, probably. We'd love to have you. That's true. Wow, Puzzles did it way better than me. If you viewers want to join my small but growing community of like-minded, good-hearted people, I do have a, tw a Discord. I was about to say a Twitch. I do have a Discord under the waiting room, which you could join there. Why not, you know, send some memes, take some quality pics, share some interesting art or fan art you might like or can do yourself, or just tease me. I'm cool with all of the above. Oh, right, I forgot. I, I have to do voices. Uh, give me one second. I don't think I'm getting on the sick side. They, hopefully not, but my voice lately has been just... Hmm. Allow me to consume some liquid encouragement. <clears throat> oh, that's better. <clears throat> Token, did you forget something? Yeah, I, I had a friend tell me, you should really, one of these days, for like a petite girl, give it the deepest voice you can. Unfortunately, it's a little too late in the game, but I wouldn't mind giving Ko uh, Toa a much stronger, gruffer voice. Did you forget something, Ko? Yeah. No, it's not that. Oh, 
Sorry for making you plan out the mission for tomorrow. Yeah, I had busy plans, but I guess that's all out of the water now that you're here. Yeah, I shouldn't probably goof off. This is probably a serious moment, right? All right, <clears throat> I'll take it seriously. M, the majority of it was decided on during the meeting earlier anyway. I just need to work out the details, and then I'll have something solid for tomorrow. Okay, if you say so. Uh, but I am a little tired. Oh, wrong. But I am a little tired. Ice cocoa? Actually, I'm not even much into chocolate, but ice cocoa sounds great right now. You want some? Yeah, sure. It goes straight to my thighs, but I'll enjoy it. I know, right? I'm sorry. Make it a really bad uh, thing, even though I just said I'd be serious. That doesn't look like iced cocoa, though. Also says, or have a cutesy tiny mascot have the deepest voice and a big intimidating man have a soft-spoken voice. Like an EK man voice? Oh, like like a very beautiful voice? Uh, let's see. I would need to think of the next game I'm planning on. And some people are already aware of this upcoming week on Twitch. I do have a premiere I've been looking forward to for quite some time. YouTube, by the time this video comes out, it probably won't be up, but I've got a, a playthrough that I've been looking forward to. I'm certain some people that have been paying attention to me know, but I'm thinking it might be a character or two and that I might be able to throw people off with my voice, so just give that a hint. But yeah, seriously, this doesn't look like iced cocoa. In fact, it looks... I can't tell. It kind of looks like milk. I, I don't know. It looks white. It's like, this is milk, right? It's like, yeah, sure. Let's go with that. Ugh. <laughs> this is seriously sweet. How can you drink this stuff? <laughs> I always make this whenever I need to do some tough mental work. You need sugar to fuel the brain, uh, fuel the brain after all. That's why I tell my friends. They're always like, I think you're going to get sick one day. It's like, eh. <laughs> Jeez, I think my teeth are melting. Toane, you have the palate of a five-year-old. What do you mean by that? I can drink black coffee. Black coffee with cream and sugar. Heh <laughs> I do feel much better, though. Everything was just getting so tangled up in my head. Uh, Puzzle says, are you more of a sweet tooth bee? Oh, wholeheartedly. Oh, gosh. I, I, I'm I, afraid of what will happen at the rate I'm going in a couple of years or so. Like, I know we're in a day and age. Uh, well, no one should want have to go to the dentist except for a checkup. I'm not saying I have uh, any cavities, at least anymore. But, uh, well, who's to say? Hopefully not. But years ago, I did have some tooth issues um, because I just consumed so much sweets. No, no, no. Uh, Toa, I don't think I'm as crazy as Toa, but, oh, are you kidding me? I would love candy. I, like, I'm not much into other things, but candy, cake, parfaits, sweets. Oh, gosh, it would get me going so fierce. Like, Something I'll always consume is any strawberry shortcake or or like like milkshake, just to single some personal things out. But to to quote my friends on this, there's numerous times where we hang out and I'll always have like a thing of candy. I don't know, just candy is dandy. I, I'm okay with that vice. I think all people in life should have some food or drink based vice to a respectively controllable degree. Don't twist my words. Those who are like, oh well, these is okay. Go to drink this moonshine. No 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 no. Don't. Don't use me for that. But if you're asking me, I'm actually... Actually, I think I have a bag of gummy worms somewhere around here. Can't find my bag of gummy worms. I'll just eat it afterwards. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. I went completely all over the fact that you just asked a simple question. So, simple answer. Yes. I have a crazy sweet tooth. In fact, my sweet tooth cravings are kicking in like fierce right now. But I can wait until I have the stream. Oops, I forgot to read the thing. Watashi ne, Kou-kun. 
thought about this for a long time. I wanted to fight alongside you. Oh, I would have loved to fight play as Toa. God, man, she'd be perfect. I don't know what her weapon would be, but give her, like, I don't know, a giant hammer? So then maybe I can watch over you better. Oh. Oh, oh, yeah, I did I That actually got me. Paul says you got it, me too. And then said check your insulin levels though. Nah, I, I don't think you I don't think it's if if they try to, I think the thing would melt be like, oh god. I think this if you check my blood right now, like I don't know, I was giving blood, they were like, excuse me, Mr. Uh, DGR, uh first name V. He's like, oh, uh yours truly, yes. He's like, yeah, so we are grateful for you donating blood, but I don't think this is acceptable for who we're giving it to. It's like, what? I don't do drugs. I'm, I'm health, pretty much healthy. It's like, there are so many trace amounts of sugar in this. Okay, that, that, that's the problem. Like, sir, it's it's as if you put red dye over sugar. That's that's your blood. Well, you know, the sugar will, like, energize you. He's like, sir, people could get sick from this. So... You're not going to take my blood? Like, no. No, you don't. Get out of here. Welcome, welcome, bay of the stream. The puzzle said, bro, get sugar particles and blood. Probably. If I'm, I think if you cut me open, it's either going to be anime stuff or sugared blood. Which is a really messed up thought, but... Yeah. Can you return my blood at least? Is what you should ask? They're not going to. They're like, sir, I think we need to quarantine you. I, I'm pretty sure you'll create some sort of next uh, pandemic. A sugar blood crisis or something. Sorry, uh, those interested in Tokyo Zandu. I'll, I'll continue that joke in a minute. I guess I should take this seriously. <clears throat> it's not something that's easy to accept. At the least. At the least? Never said it like that. At the least, I want to be able to provide the light to this place. So that no matter how hurt you are, you can still come back. Oh. Oh, damn it. This is why she's the best girl. Kokun, I don't know what's making you hesitate. Please don't be afraid to keep moving forward. As the advisor to the XRC and a member too. I'll be cheering you on so that you can find your answer. Keep moving forward, huh? I'm sorry. That's all the help I can give. Since we're only cousins, maybe I'm not close enough to be a proper mentor. No, you've done more than enough. Thanks, Toane. I know. All of us know exactly how worried you are as you wait for us to return. We know you're putting on a brave face for our sakes. I can't count how many times that's saved us. Oh, so cute. And I. Oh, wait, that's Ko. And I know that tomorrow night. Oof, I messed that up. Something fierce. Sorry, let me try that again. And I know that tomorrow night, uh, tomorrow might make you worry even more. But I promise I'll come back. So, wait for me. <laughs> oh, it's so. I will! Oh, it's so cute! Together in XRC club room, should be in the, but whatever. We sat in companionable silence for a time. Your bond with Toa got stronger. A Kokonoe charm? Oh, 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 there's actually something that 
Toa or not Toa? Forge an unbreakable bond with Toa. Oh! So it's like max out the bonds that ranks? Okay, I gotta check that out. But really quickly, I apologize, chat. I haven't read you guys in a second. Uh, I don't want to, like, cut you guys out. Let's see here. Um, Going to Bayo. Bayo says, new story has generally caught my interest. Don't talk about vengeance! I haven't played it yet. I still need to get the money for it. I'll get it in time. I'll get it in time. Puzzle says, you could do a thing where you're like... Oh, okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. <clears throat> Puzzle says, uh, in regards to the whole, like, sweet blood thing. About blood sugar, uh, sugar in my uh, blood. Also says, you could do a thing where you're like, Sate to. Not that. It says a thing like, you could do a thing where you're like, Is it sweet like my voice? The voice you can't forget? Although I feel puzzles if I do say that, I'll be like, Sir, while that's a very good deep voice, we're gonna have to arrest you. you like, seriously, you're becoming a pain. It's like, uh oh, well, I, sorry. The what, you don't like this lovely voice? Like, sir, we're gonna call the local authorities. I'll see you later. It's like, uh, hey, hey, I was just kidding. I was just kidding. A coconut charm, huh? Whoa. Toa's handmade charm adorned with a seal of coconut. Oh, well, I have to equip it. Like, why would I not? Oh, it's not that good compared to the stuff I have. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, says they might take you to a ward. Wait, you know what? Well, I mean, I don't know. Would they detain me? I am a licensed vitamin, so they might. Hmm. At the same time, I really do want this. I lose five crit and my stuff will go lower, but I think it's too good to pass up. I can't. It, Toa made it for me. I have to. I'll, I'll take the, the lowerness. Even though... Really good. Oh well. Less. Can I equip this and this is better? Um, not really much better. I don't really know. Whoa! What? What? Uh... Wait, hold. Uh. Puzzles just, uh, uh, you hi. Uh, how 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 do I how how do I respond? How am I supposed to? I'm stuttering. Let me take a second to calm down. I'm sorry. Give me a second, folks. YouTube, I apologize. Twitch, I know you can see what just happened. Give me a, a second to try and process what the flip puzzles just did. Puzzles, you. Yeah. All right. Let me calm down. <sighs> okay. In the calmest way I can say this. Puzzles, allow me to thank you for gifting 10 tier 1 subs to Vimin DGR's community. Yes, this was my first high trade. Thank you for the subs. But now that I've done it in a calm method, if you don't mind, I apologize for those listening to headphones. Holy frick, Puzzles just gifted subs. Thank you. Thank you. I... I cannot believe you just hype train. That was my first hype train. Honestly, that was. I. This. Puzzles the stream is sponsored by me. Yep. It's official. This episode slash stream is dedicated to objectable puzzles. Please. Twitch, I know you can see it. YouTube. Please. I just need you to do this for me. If there's one thing. I, okay, I usually ask you guys a lot. I apologize. I'm greedy. I'm selfish. I'm spoiled. I like eating candy. But I need you guys to do this for me. Everyone listening right now, before I go any further, on YouTube, when this video comes out, please, I beg of you, and then Twitch, of course, spread it out in uh, Discord, but please, please, shout out Objectable Puzzles. I don't know what you have to do, but please praise this person. Let the anime gods bless this person with all that is right and just and sugary and holy in this world. If you like the anime culture, if you like the finer things in life, then you will do this for me. Thank you. I apologize. I had to calm down. Fail says, and again with the theme of the person in the chat doesn't get one. Twitch, why do you do this? I don't know why you do. Puzzle, stop. Slow down. Please stop giving subs. I'm so grateful, though, because I, I, I seriously, thank you so much. I don't know why they didn't, uh, why they didn't but congrats, Bale, you just got a sub. And now I have lost completely my train of thought of what I was going to do because of this. Although it's funny that they did give, uh, 
They did give Calvin Miller one, who also does follow me. Uh, Calvin Miller is a voice actor who actually is a really good content creator. Please subscribe to him. Uh, <laughs> Puzzle said, no more pesky ads. That's true. For a good month, you guys don't have to deal with those annoying pesky ads, which means you don't have to worry about subscribing. But of course, for those listening and you want to subscribe, I'm not going to stop you. I'd be greatly appreciated, but I'm not going to ask for that. I'm trying to get out of the habit of, uh, I feel like I ask too much. I feel like I shouldn't be that kind of person. Even though I am trying to make it in life. Because, you know, aren't we all? Thank you for bearing with my rant. My TED Talk. I don't know how to respond. I, I feel like I can't calm down. I've, I've never had a hype train before. I was, I I've seen it. I've been a part of one way back when. But I never, like, did it. I never thought I would have it. I, 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 I'm stammering. I'm sorry. I can't calm down. And what sucks is YouTube. I don't know. I don't have the ability to chat overlay. But you have to trust me. I, 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 I don't know what to say. I really don't know what to say. I'm so sorry. I, I don't really don't stammer this much. I'm just... Do I deserve it? I don't think I deserve it. I don't think I really do. I'm very grateful. I'm not saying I'm appreciative. I just... Why? Now I gotta calm down to do... And you realize, Goro, I gave him the calm, gentle version of my voice. And now I gotta act calm and out of character? Alright, give me a second. I just gotta take some breaths. I'm sorry. Just... Ooh, okay. Gotta calm down. People don't need to hear me going crazy. I just need to calm down. Oh. Well, says I was gonna fund the whole PC sub goal, but I thought you might freak... Please don't! Oh god, please don't. Please... Don't, 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 don't. I, I do not deserve it. Let me grow bigger as a brand and do more for you and everyone else before I get like any more subs or, or, or donations or anything like that. Please, I, I would not feel right at all. I'm not trying to do sympathy. I'm not trying to do pity. I know I, I am trying in life, but please, I, I, I need to deserve it. If I don't, I'm, I'm not gonna be able to sleep right. I already have my own sleep problems, but Jesus. Oh, we love you, man. Accept my love. I do. I love you. I love all of you. But I just, I need a minute. I, just, I need to calm down. Plus, I can't break YouTube's immersion, even though people on YouTube are like, oh, well, B's just going to spend this whole episode losing his mind. Well, I mean, yeah. It's, all right. Just give me give me a second. Sorry, chat. I, I need to. For this cutscene for Goro, I'm not going to look at chat. I just need to not look at chat right now so I don't get crazy. I'll do it next time when you least expect it. Please don't. Please, please don't. Please don't. Okay, okay. YouTube, I have you have my focus right now. All right? No breaking immersion. I'm not gonna let anybody get me overhyped. We're gonna just have a calm episode. Oh, okay. Who's talking? Ko? Okay. There you are, Go Sensei. <laughs> okay. There you are, Go Sensei. <laughs> Oh, Doki Saka-kun. Excuse me. I didn't intend on smoking at school, but it's a bad habit of mine. Puts you in a pretty really tough spot being a teacher and a smoker. Bale says, on Tuesday during Eater Nights because you won't expect you there at all. Please, definitely don't. Oh, no! Puzzles won't do it! Because Puzzles wants to play Eater Nights. They won't do that at all. Then, uh, uh, then puzzles or Bale said that. Excuse me. Then puzzle said, "Did Goro turn out to be sus like I thought?" Um, to get you up to speed, uh, Goro is actually part of the military, the Japanese defense military branch, specifically designed to uh, handle the eclipse. So definitely threw me for a loop. But in simple terms, Goro's good. Goro's a good guy. I kind of feel dumb thinking about it, but it is what it is. Oh, oh, and to also get you up to speed, because I know you've been out of it for a second. Uh, June, the green-haired little boy that, or little boy, the green-haired friend, um, is the knight. He, he is the Orden Knight, the, um, White Shroud, which, again, really didn't see that coming, so, flip me running. <clears throat> Considering the situation... Oh, whoops, that's me. Considering the situation, I don't think people care since it's you. Well, 
I didn't expect you to be such a heavy smoker. <laughs> Had every opportunity to quit. But after I joined the self defense force, it just became routine. If Utawa were alive, she'd give me an earful. That watch, was it? Yes. It was a match gift we got when I entered university. We told each other that we would be reminders of the decades we'd spend together. A promise, really. That's what it was supposed to be for, anyway. <laughs> Sounds sentimental. <laughs> I was naive back then, too. But in the end, the watch I gave her that day stopped. And my time stopped with it. Goro-sensei. I couldn't save Futaba. But you still have your chance. Even if you don't know what to do, as long as you don't stand still. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know what to say. Like you, I'm just an immature brat. What can I really do? Oh, hold on. This music's actually kind of hitting. Hmm. There are lots of things only you can do. Just like the defeat of the breed earlier. When you and the XRC jumped in, my time that had stopped since that day began to move again. That's why, if you ever stand still, I'll be there to nudge you forward. I may be a member of the SDF, but above all, I'm Goro Saiki, a teacher of Morimiya Academy. Thought <laughs> your position here was just camouflage. You pretend to be nice, but you're actually pretty strict. You may be a soldier, but you're still the same teacher to me. <laughs> as long as you guys call me your teacher, that's what I'll be. Good luck, Tokisaka. I lost my time long ago. Please, don't lose yours. I understand. I'll try my best in my own way. Oh god, I'm getting emotional. I didn't want this episode to be super... I knew it was going to be emotional, but I didn't think it was going to get me. Between what's happening in chat, between what's happening with puzzles, between what's happening in this game, I don't have the heart for this. And both of them, girl sees a reflection of his younger self and co, I assume. Love those tropes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, hit the nail on the head. An ally in Goro. Yeah, so it... Wait. They gave me that for Goro? Wait, where is Goro's thing? 
Uh, now I feel bad because I didn't. I skipped this other one because I thought he was bad. Now I feel like a jerk. Oh, wait. It wasn't Goro's information. Who did I get? Oh, I got yours. A uh, fighting spirit with a wooden sword in hand. He fought alongside Shio and his crew, showing a true fighting spirit that he did battle. Speaking of which, I'm going to talk to Shio next after this. Oh, his, he's done. Uh, the Yakuza guy is done. The self-defense force, along with other allied forces, acquire consecrated bullets. Those plus a Gatling gun. I forgot he had that. Let him mow down Grease with ease. Is there anyone else? Just in case, before I'm forgetting anybody. Yep. His uh, late girlfriend. She bought herself and Goro matching watches so they could symbolically spend the same time together. Oh, that's so cute! I think that's one of the most romantic things, folks. I'm sorry. Uh, where Where is Shio? I'm gonna go talk to Shio next. Shio is on the third floor of the uh, other area. Okay, I'm gonna do that first. Nice. I'm gonna talk to Shio. Um, I think that's one of the sweetest things. Because I, I don't want to get like, morbid or, or eerie or anything, but I want people to realize, no matter what, I think the most precious resource, more than money, more than food, and yes, it's going to be a shock, but even more than anything to me is time. Like, every second is worth more than anything. Even if you may think otherwise. Where the flip is Shio? Sorry, I'm getting a little distracted here. Shio should be around here. Um... So, obviously, don't waste every second. Like, enjoy every minute of it. Also, this is the second floor. That makes sense. Um, but just the ability to spend time, let alone just a second with someone, it just moves so many mountains. So when I hear a couple getting matching watches together because they want to share their time or symbolically spend the exact same amount of time together, oh, gosh. I didn't realize I was this much of a romantic. Oh, right. What was Shio's again? I gotta make sure I don't get Shio and Goto confused here. I think Goto was the one that kind of grated on my throat, and Shio's is... Shio-senpai? <laughs> Shio-senpai? What are you doing here? Nothing. You seem to be wandering around a lot. Feeling restless? <laughs> I guess so. I don't really know why, though. What up? Wait, what? Why does he not have a voice? Whatever the case, don't overdo it. If you're tired, sleep. Do the rest to us. <laughs> Thanks. Wait, what? Why didn't I get a... What the flip? Why Why didn't I get a cutscene for Shio? Oh, wait. Hold on. I think I have an idea. Maybe, uh... What is... No? No? That doesn't make sense. Why didn't I get a cutscene for Shio? Anyone else got one? But since I'm at this, and since this is pretty much the end of the area, I guess there's no point in saving all these... No one cares about the stuff. A flip? What do you mean no one cares about the stuff? All these, like, gift items I was going to save, I figured this was a good time to save it. Now I have it in my hand is exactly how I thought it'd be. Glad I bought it. Oh, wait, that gives me health, too? I should have been using this way earlier. It's so shiny and heavy, but it's kind of cute. I guess I'll keep it for now. I think I might have messed something up, y'all. Oh, no. Do I have to have my friends with me? Oh, then I got an idea. Um, Let me go... I wonder if this will work. Remember this old dungeon, folks? Okay, let's try this. Um, Sora, Yuki, Shio. There we go. Okay, so I need to have the characters in the team. All right. Holy crap, Soba Shop Gandam is in here. Never thought the old man's shop would be in here. It'd be cool to talk with him about this. I'm just gonna rip through this really quickly, because there's really no point in not doing this, but I don't know why I didn't give get a cutscene with Shio. Okisaka, this is I heard this particular brand is really popular in Japan right now. 
I thought you'd like to give it to uh, like, English. I thought you'd like to give it a try, Hiragi. I get the feeling that's hardly the reason. But I'll take it and your reason. Thanks. I don't know why I'm not getting this. Well, I'm still gonna give it to her anyway. We'll just rush through these. Uh, because you're always looking after me, Hiragi. Think of it as a token of appreciation. Appreciation, huh? Thank you. Is Code, like, tripping flags left and right without thinking? Sora, Yuki... Alright, Chio. Here we go. Huh. <laughs> Pretty sweet. Why are you giving it to me? It just kind of caught my eye when I was out, and I thought it'd be perfect for you. You had my back throughout all the madness, so I thought I should get you something to thank you. Heh. <laughs> I'll be doing the same for you. Anyway, I'm not gonna tear it down. Thanks. Maybe it's because his rank is really low? Holy crap, these are... These are seriously nice knives. Yeah, I saw the set of Kukuraya and thought they'd be perfect for you. Hopefully you'll be able to put them to good use. Oh yeah, I'll put them to good use. All those greeds are about to become shish kebabs. They're way too expensive to be giving as a gift. I'm sure as hell I'm not gonna turn you down. I'll be sure to make you something delicious with these. God, he gives me such Shinjiro vibes. I hope, uh... Oh, Shio ends up becoming, like, a very well-loved and well-live... Uh, like, a person with a very long life. If you get what I'm saying here. Uh, that's all for you guys. Wow, that really didn't do anything, huh? Oops. And still nothing for Shio? Huh. I wonder why I haven't gotten Shio's thing. Was there a scene I missed with Shio? I didn't think there was. There isn't. So then why why do I not have a... Maybe it isn't an area where Shio's going to have a personal bond with me? I don't know. I, I, don't, I, I don't know. Like, I would understand... Wait, you know what? No, that doesn't make sense. It has to be something later. Sorry, I, I'm going in my head here, but hear me out, right? So we had a moment with Goro, right? Just now, which was really sweet and touching. But I missed one of Goro's things way back when because I thought he was bad and I was just like, eh. Which, again, in retrospect, I regret it. But I was still able to have a good moment. I wonder if maybe it's not going to be every character having a moment because I just thought about something. Shio doesn't have an exclamation mark and neither does Rion. And I'm pretty darn confident I've been bonding with Rion. So there's definitely something. I wonder if there's gonna be like another like point of no return area maybe, or I missed something in the past. I mean, regardless, what's done is done. So I suck, I guess, but it is what it is. Um, do I need to discuss you guys? Are you important before my friends? Not that I should be saying like this because it's messed up, but I kind of want to spend time with my friends because I really want to go to the tower. Did you fall asleep standing up? Oh, I was quite awake. I'm tired from acting as liaison for my father's company. That's absurd. Uh-huh. Yeah. Where's Mitsuki? Okay. Why I got Mitsuki's moment and not, um, Rion's is only be something interesting. But alright, here we go. <laughs> right, I forgot. What is her voice again? <laughs> Tokisaka-kun, welcome to the student council room. Can't sleep? So you akeja. Mitsuki senpai wa nani shite It's not that. Anyway, what are you doing, Mitsuki? Sorry, puzzles. I know Shio's your fave. I don't know why we didn't get like a touching moment with Shio, unless there's something I missed. I, I really don't know. Hopefully, I didn't miss anything. If so, I really do apologize. Kyoka san kara no. I'm looking through the investigation report that Kyoka-san uh, Kyoka compiled about the city. We decided on the main points of the mission at the meeting, but not everything may go to plan. We must consider all possibilities and be prepared for anything that might happen. I see. You're absolutely right. <laughs> you really are something. Anyway, let's put aside work for now. Yeah, 
I'm almost done, so won't you join me for a cup of tea? Depends. Is it actually going to be tea? With Toa, I thought it was going to be iced cocoa, but it turned out to be what looked like milk. Okay, that kind of looks like tea. Mmm. It's really good. There's this refreshing lemon smell, but the tea doesn't taste sour at all. I'm glad the medication I slipped in there is working. He's like, what? And then all of a sudden, Koa just passes out. And then, I don't know, she just has this sadistic smile. It's like, mm, 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 mm. delicious. Also, it says, uh, it says to talk to the owners of the Soba restaurant, but I'm not 100% sure. Can I go? A after this cutscene, I'll, I'll check it out. I'll see if I can. <clears throat> I'm glad I had some extra lemon balm on the hand. It has a calming effect, so it's perfect for the situation. Thanks, Senpai. I've always been a rock during this kind of stuff. <laughs> it's nothing. That's what teammates are for. No, I'm sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I always feel supported by everyone. I don't like to burden others with my troubles, but when I do need to talk, you've always listened. Like a good friend. That's why it's my turn today. Huh? Well, uh, don't, don't put you put your, don't, don't, don't put, don't put your hand on my chest, don't put my hand on your chest. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna lose it if you do. I, I can't handle this. Tokisaka, thank you. People can look past the roles they were given and overcome hurdles to support one another. You taught me that. Mitsuki-senpai. Senpai. I may not be very powerful. You're like the strongest. I may not be very powerful, but. And think we could come together, Giggity, a little more and straighten that support. Before my role as a member of Zodiac. I am the student council president. And above even that, I am Mitsuki Ho- Actually, B. And above even that, I am Hokuto Mitsuki, the individual. Alright, never mind. I want to help you the best that I can for all the help you've given me. Yeah, all indeed. Thanks. Really. I'll try to find the answer by myself. Wait, what? I'll try to find the answer by myself? But didn't she just say, like, it was good to, you know, come together and work at this kind of thing together? Oh, oh, okay. I get it. He wants to figure it out first and then share with everybody else, even though I feel like that defeats the purpose. Whatever. So can you watch over me just a little while longer? That way I can reach that destination on my own. <laughs> I will. I think you'll be fine. I believe in my heart that you will be able to find the best path. <laughs> Shall we resume our tea time? Please be sure to get some rest tonight so that you'll be prepared for tomorrow. <laughs> I definitely will. After what everyone's doing to me this episode. It was during a Tokyo Xandu episode, too, of all the playthroughs I was doing. After that, we enjoyed some sweets that Mitsuki Senpai took out. I would have loved some sweets. See? Why? Salutations, milady. They spelled Mitsuki wrong in the trophies! 
Are you serious? You spelled the trophies for PlayStation wrong? It's M-I-T-S-U-K-I. -S Come on, Sony. I'll do everything I can to support you. If it's you, Tokisaka, everything will work out. I believe you'll lead us on the right path. I want to go on the right path to you. Um, I can't go to the shopping street. Ooh. Damn it. Also says, it wrote me... It did, didn't it? Also, I, I didn't mean to uh, cut over your early things because you said you just friend zone, girl. I gotta know, like, come on, Mitsuki, I'm trying. Let's just go out with me. Uh, I right, plan, I plan, I plan. But the puzzle says it wrote Mitsuki right for bonded with Mitsuki. It did, didn't it? I don't know why it just didn't do it this time. You'd think you would get both of these things right, but you know what? Only in a, a niche game like this, huh? Um, So I can't leave. I think because I have to go, like, rest for the evening. So... Is there anyone really to talk to? Is anyone on the roof? Rion's on the roof. Rion. If you, you're, why are you singing? I love your voice. Don't get me wrong, but wasn't it last time you sung "Bad Things Happen"? <laughs> the boss says she's always your ass is always singing. Rion! Not when you get in the water. That song. Why do you only catch me when I'm singing? Wait, is, are we having a bonding moment? Oh, hey, Kukun. Sorry, didn't mean to interrupt the fact that, you know, every time you sing, your angel powers may go out of control here. <laughs> Oh, relax. That was just, like, a couple episodes or so ago. It's all good. Actually, was that the voice I gave Rion? I think I gave it a lot more cringe here. I think it was... But you sure do seem to pop up whenever I'm singing. <laughs> you positive you're not secretly a groupie of mine? Total coincidence, I swear. I love Ko's subtle smile. He looks bashful looking up like that. I think he because he secretly does like care a great deal for Rion, but I've a, I've definitely come to the understanding, especially doing this for how many episodes, that Ko is literally the male version of a Sundere. Not that your song isn't good. That was Wish Star Wing, right? Even though we don't say the little characters in the middle, so we just say Wish a Wing, right? <laughs> Yep. <clears throat> Ooh. Yep. You become my favorite thanks to you guys. When I hum this tune, I feel like I'm not alone. Okay, I don't know why I'm being sing song. Yeah, I need to stop. I think Rion singing is getting to me. Let's see. Don't mind me. Keep singing. I'm sure everyone at the school feels better for it. Give it to me. Is she gonna sing again? Yeah, she's gonna sing again. Wait, I didn't get a bonding moment? Or what? Okay, there must be something I'm definitely missing. I am pretty darn confident I've been doing everything with Rion. So, I'm definitely missing something here. Oh, it's her next, or it's her second to last one. Uh, Song of the Heart. The memories of fighting alongside her fellow XRC members are brought to the fore when listening to her favorite song, Wishwing. Also said, what if her singing makes the sky more distorted? I'm still on it, because... We're still on the understanding that Rion can control her power, but is that a hundred percent a guarantee? What if like something happens, wrong button, and I don't know, it just goes wild. Oh, uh, really quickly. Speaking of Rion, might as well just have Rion do it. Okay, who do we talk to? We talk to Goro. We talk to Toa. We talk to Mitsuki. We talk to Shio. We talk to Rion. Um, I want to save that question mark one for the end, even though I think it's gonna be Ryota. So let's go to Yuki in the computer lab. Oh, what are you girls at? Uh, I'm passing out things my mom and other people from the mall gave me. Everyone should be preoccupied with their own business, but they're being so nice. It must be the way of the samurai. I have to learn to do the same. I gotta stay positive. I gotta work really hard with everyone. Never change, Cotton. Never change. I'm staying late to help out of school. Everyone told me I should go home, but as a class president, I can't just go home and leave everyone else here. 
You need to do my best so that everyone can return home safely tomorrow. Yeah, and clearly not because you're trying to spend time with, um, what's her face? Uh, what's his face? Ryota. Uh, I thought it was just the late night anime, but even the news isn't airing. That station's always on, but now it's not. It's definitely... Oh, wait, it's you! <laughs> that station's always on, but now it's not. It's definitely being affected, too. I must work hard to get back to our original world. I'm so sorry. I didn't even pay attention to who I was, uh, reading. Uh, maybe after talking to everyone here, you get to go somewhere else and unlock more locations at Bonds? If so, then this game is way longer than I realized. Holy moly. Type, type, type. Oh. No oh, good. Yuki. Still at it, Yuki? Yeah, I was hoping to gain access to the tower. Maybe to control the servers in Morimiya to some degree using the Zyphone special mode. やっぱりパンドラの内部にはどうやっても侵入できなさそうだ。ドラズ Fighting game. Oh, that sounds baller. Bale says, why does my mind hate me? I want to get some rest, but my ADHD mind just won't let me. Because you can't. Now, despite my voice being so soothing that it should worry you not and be able to rest easy, you can't resist me. You will now submit and watch my episodes. And then, once it's done, you can fall asleep. Be a change of pace from all this craziness? Oh. Be a change of pace for all this craziness. Finding game. <laughs> yeah, sure. What is it? Tekken? Street Fighter? Why not? Go easy on me, though. No, we're gonna play a game that's only due to the most cultured people. Melty Blood. How's their electricity, actually? If you were in the situation you had to play one last game, uh-oh. What would it be? I knew you were going to ask something like that, Puzzle. Damn it! Alright. Um, first off, I don't know about the electricity. Maybe they have a generator or maybe electricity works, but a very small supply. Um, if it was like my last game... Hmm. My last game. I... I... I'm torn. Because I'm torn between three. It would either be... My copy of Persona 4 Golden. Because I've already said a million one times that Persona 4 is my favorite game of all time. Or... It would be this other game that um, I do have. I kind of don't want to talk too much detail on it. But I will talk detail on it anyway. Um, I was going to recommend... Uh, um, gosh, what I'm spacing on my name. So, there was a game I used to play when I was young, and I was fascinated by it. Judge me how you will, but it was a PS2 game called Air Tunnel Lico. I think that's how you spell it, or I think that's how you say it. Um, then, yes, when you look at the cover of it, you're gonna be like, oh, yeah, of course you're gonna like it, because there's one guy and a bunch of cute anime girls, but hear me out. The music in that game, they invented their own language I think they called harmonics or something. It's been a long time. I'm actually trying to like find that game, but unfortunately I can't buy it because I'm saving up for uh, better stuff and stuff. But I want to get my hands on that game, and if I can like you know let YouTube let me play it, I'd be more than happy to play it. Um, unfortunately it's been years, and I know that there's two or three in the series, and I've only played. Gosh, I think it was the second one. It's the one that has, I think that one of the girls has like black hair, the other girl's blonde, but again, unfortunately, memory is gone for me, so I don't know. But that would be number two, if it was it. Um, my third game, all jokes aside, would probably be Kirby. I I, I would probably end up playing Planet Robopod, because I think that's probably my favorite Kirby. Ooh, actually Forgotten Land's up there, too. No, I, I would give it to Planet Robot. So it would either be Persona 4, 
if, I don't know, my copy of Persona 4 died down, then it would be Air Tunnel Eco if I could get my hands on it. But realistically, even more than Persona, it probably end up being Kirby, because Kirby's such a feel-good game. Like, way back when, I'm sorry, YouTube, I'm breaking immersion really quickly, but this is actually a very serious, well, sort of serious story. Um, it should be up on YouTube by this moment, but a long while ago, I was going through some really bad depression. It, it sucked. I'm just being real with you guys. And I was having a really bad day. And I played an episode of Kirby in the Forgotten Lands just to, like, cheer me up. Um, and I don't know, I, I actually felt a good deal better playing Kirby. I don't know, something about that little pink marshmallow just made me feel better about things. I, I, I don't really know how to play. And if you're wondering if I'm sad, obviously I'm not. I'm, I'm feeling really good. This is while, this is a long while, I'm, I'm definitely better. So if you're, like, feeling like, oh, B, we're sorry, don't. It's all good, it's all good. But yeah, I'm just I'm keeping it 100% honest with you guys. Uh, I think Kirby might end up being the game I play. Any Kirby game, really. I would uh, I would definitely go for Planet Robobot, but technically any Kirby will probably end up being the thing that, like, you know, cheer me up and stuff. I don't know. That will probably be my thing. But what about you guys on YouTube and Twitch? If it was, if you were in this circumstance where you're about to, like, face, like, an end-of-the-world dungeon, and you had only one last night to play one game, I'll even go further and expand on it. It could be a board game, video game, mobile game, but what's the game you would play if you're interested in games? Uh, Bale says, you normally help me sleep, but nope, not tonight. Well, like I said, you're not getting any rest today. Then they said, yeah, I remember that episode. Yeah, it was a long time ago. <laughs> Puzzle says, everyone say, thank you, jo thank you, John Kirby. Oh, we're, I like how we have a bit now where every time we come up with a persona for something, no pun intended, it's always John something, like John Atlas, John Kirby. Next is going to be John Falcom, if I play, like, more of the Falcom games. I think we should stick with it, because John's a really good name. Sorry, I'll, I'll go back to the game. I just wanted to share that with you guys really quickly. <clears throat> All that going easy on me? Good. I use, like, 70% of my skills. Guess 45% would have given you a chance to land a hit. Maybe. What are you, the Aizawa from, uh, is this a zombie? Like, what? Why are you getting these percentages? There goes my motivation. <laughs> Don't give up just because you suck. Let's play again. Also says this has double meaning because the real Kirby is based on what the lawyer John Kirby. I did hear something like that. I don't know the whole story about that though, but I did hear that the reason why they gave birth to uh, the Kirby franchise was because they met someone named Kirby, yeah? Or was inspired by Kirby? But I always figured it was something connected to, like, a vacuum cleaning service. Hmm. Or, no, 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 what I'm, maybe I'm thinking, I think there was another thing later down the road that other people came to the thought, but... Wasn't it something like, it was either one of two things, and obviously, chat, you can correct me if I'm wrong. I know some of you guys are, I know most of you guys are way smarter than me. I don't know where I heard it from, but was it a circumstance where Nintendo was losing a lot, and it was about to be really bad, but a lawyer saved them and it was like oh well we inspired you to name it after kirby so boom but i also heard a circumstance where vacuums were also involved and it was a company called kirby so puzzle says oh, oh w puzzles w oh well first bale says in that case what is a doe named jane oh well we're gonna have to have a female one soon i don't know jane okami jane eater knights we'll come out with something soon uh, Puzzle says, Don Joseph Kirby Jr. was an American attorney who defended Nintendo against a lawsuit from Universal Studios in 1984 over the character of Donkey Kong because he was too similar to King Kong. He quite literally saved Nintendo from bankruptcy. I did not know that. I might have heard something similar, but I honestly do I did not know that. That's fascinating. W America in Japan. See? When we get together, beauty. Beauty happens. Don't talk about past circumstances. あのさ、先輩。Actually, you know what? Sorry, puzzles. We're not dedicating the episode to you. We're dedicating this episode to John Joseph Kirby Jr. from here on out. W to John Joseph Kirby in the chat. Okay, I'm still playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. <clears throat> What's everything back to no uh, once everything's back to normal, is there something you want to do? What's with you all of a sudden? Bale says, hey, you caught on to the John J. Dojo. Come on. 
not that bad. Well, I can't really think of anything. I just want things to go back to the way they were. Work oh, okay. I was like, wait, why does it based why did it time it like that? Working, hanging out with my friends, going to class. Getting my butt handed to me in games. What? That's super boring. Wanting your own life back makes you sound like the guy in a movie who's about to bite it. Well, that's not ominous or anything. And you? There's something you want to do? Uh, for me... Really? Reminder, Yuki and his dad do not sit eye to eye. They can't stand each other. And Yuki ran away from home, for lack of a better term, because he couldn't stand his father after what happened to their... I think their mother passed some... Yeah, their mother passed some time ago. It is interesting hearing Yuki say he wants to go visit home with his sis. I guess I want to visit my home with my sister. That's... Not that I have any intention of making things up my old man. It's such a crazy plan surely wouldn't trip any death flags, right? Wow, I get it. If it was the last moments and... He'd rather spend time giving his family one last... Oh gosh, that's so emotional. Never quite honest with yourself, are you? Still, you can do it. Good for you. Senpai, such a dork. Be sure you keep that a secret for my sis. <laughs> you want to make her worry about you. I got it. It's not like that. Gosh, don't make it all gushy. Anyway, let's just make it through tomorrow. We'll avoid all the death flags and get what we want. Yeah, counting on you. Sen oh, wait, wrong voice. Yeah, I'm counting on you, senpai. We played a few more games together until I realized that even landing a hit was a dream far beyond my reach. Pride took a hit, but your bond with Yuki got stronger. All right, game. How do you have moments where you make little jokes like that, but you can't get Mitsuki's name right? Make it up your make up your mind. Oh, but Yuki's maxed out. Cool on you. Uh, Muscle says, I'll take it honestly. Shout out to John Joseph Kirby. Then said, bro was building a harem without discrimination. Both boys and girls love co. Seriously, that's the power of a harem protagonist. What? Oh, I get it. Different ways of saying you. You, 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 and you, Key. That's a really dumb trophy. Okay, game. You need to stop. You need to calm down. I get it. You can have fun writing however you want the trophies, but that's just... That's just dumb. We gotta take care of this fast tomorrow so we can move on to other things. Count on you, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, that was a dumb trophy. I like it, though. It was really sweet, honestly. Uh, who's left? Who's left? I don't want to go to 2B yet. Because I feel like that's important. We got June, we got Ryota, we got Asuka, and we have Sora. So, not many left. Let's go talk to... Sora. I'm handing out food to everyone who worked hard today. Please take some. Oh, sick! Apple pie? Oh, I could totally go for some apple pie right now. Thank you. Sora must be over the dojo. I think I'll bring some food over to her and everyone resting in the auditorium. Oh, that's so bomb. Apple pie is something you can't mess up until you mess it up. Tomorrow will be the day... Who was this? Oh, tomorrow will be the day that the creator of our school has decided 
As a faculty of Morimi Academy, we uh, must overcome this together with our students. <laughs> of course we will. We'll show them what we're made of. Yes, I agree. We shall join together as teachers and persevere. Oh, well, that was information. Whoops. Uh, for who? The teachers? Oh, this one's done. Chief Executive's pride. With the principal absent, he's now the person in charge. He gathers the staff and vows to overcome the supernatural threat. Uh, puzzle says, I wonder what the teacher's one would be. Oh. I don't know, actually. Hmm. Unfortunately, I don't think I spent a... Wait, didn't I? Um... Wait, didn't I just get one with, uh, what's-his-face? Um... Did I get this? No, I didn't. I don't- I really don't mess with trophies as much. Where is... I'm just gonna give you all the trophies. Where is Goro's? Let's just scroll down here. Where is Goro? I should not be reading some of these, because I feel like some of these are spoilers, but I'm also not really paying much attention. Uh, um... Asuka, Sora, Yu, Shio, Mitsuki, Rion, Shiori, Ryota, Jun, Toa, an ally and Goro. Wow, that's, uh, that's it. An ally and Goro. I was about to say, because I did get that trophy, but I guess I didn't really pay much attention to it. Alright, done. Do us make us proud? Okay. And best of all, because I was skimming through it, I feel like some of those were probably spoiler stuff. I usually don't like looking up trophies because I feel like it spoils me for what's to come. But luckily, I just kind of skimmed through it, so I don't really know what's going on here. And I don't really think I need to talk to you, so moving on. Hi, Togisaka. Taking a breathing auditorium? Yep. Also, did you know that your brother wants to, like, go and hang out with your, uh, wants to hang out with your dad? And then I was just like, what? And then she just bolts for her brother. Sorry, Yuki. Aoi, don't you need to see Yuki? Wait, are you about to... It's fine. He seems busy. This is the first time I've been to the school, you know. It's really nice. Being here, meeting you and the others. I think Yuki-kun's matured a lot thanks to that. Feels like a weight's been lifted from my shoulders. Aoi, nay. I have it for you. Really? Oh, I shouldn't be saying nay, because I'm not your, uh, sibling. Tomorrow's week day, get some rest? I will. Thank you. Not creative? Eh, they have their moments, I guess. Got anything new? Nope. Okay. Well, just rip it through this. Oh, do I have new things? You need to bring in new dishes? I want to eat more kinds. Oh, we do need to cook. I'm in the middle of I'm in the middle of writing an article about everything you guys have done. Tomorrow's the final battle, so I'm hoping this will help boost everyone's spirits. Good luck tomorrow. The newspaper club is cheering you on. Wow, no pressure. So how was it? Think they can help? Yes, they'll finish by tomorrow morning. It's not much time, so they can't prepare very many. Any is fine. We'll be able to What the heck are they planning? I think Sora heads to the dojo. I'll let her be for tonight. Wait, what the heck are you guys planning for tomorrow? We're gonna head to the gym after we finish up here. I think Fuka's helping with the bedding. Go thank her, take a rest. What are you guys doing? I remember what it's like during the earthquake ten years ago. I was scared then, and I'm scared of spit now. And everyone at the evacuation area in the school has been so kind. I feel much better now. Seriously, guys, off topic. There's an anime that came out a little while ago called Grandma and Grandpa Turn Young Again. I feel like I talked about it before, if not on this, a different playthrough. If you're interested in an anime, I give it a watch. It's really cute. Despite the situation, you students are doing a great job. Sometimes I hear the old folks say, kids these days. I don't know, but you know, I don't agree. I think the youth of today are pretty admirable. I mean, with their hashtag and their tweets and their dances and their jigs and whatever. You're... Nobody says... Alright, whatever. I'm gonna go talk to Sora. Who's just standing alone in the dojo? Sora? Are you okay? Sora, what happened? I hope they get a good satsang with her. I really do like Sora. Something wrong, Sora? What are you doing here alone? Kou-senpai... I didn't have any advice. Oh, Kou-senpai! Uh huh? It's nothing, really. This place just means a lot to me. I hope that I can overcome tomorrow so I can come back here. Hey, Senpai, off topic, but if we don't make it back, if you had one last opportunity to have one last meal, what would it be? What do you mean? Like, 
Say you're in the circumstance right now, right? And you could eat one thing, only one last thing. It had to be your last potential meal. What would you choose? Um... I don't know, probably a burger or sushi. One of the two. I'm pretty basic when it comes to that. I don't know, what about you guys in chat slash YouTube? If you were in the circumstance, I'm, we did a, basically the a game conversation, but I'm trying to get you guys engaged again. It was your last meal before you're about to go rush off into danger. You only get one. You can't multi. You can't be like, oh, I want pasta, but also steak. If I had to simplify, it would be burger for sure. But if by some miracle it wasn't a burger, then be sushi. You only get to choose two. I'll be fair. You get to choose two. Your number one and your number two. What would be your two? So that's right. Summer competition is close. Until then. Yeah, we'll be able to concentrate at the training camp at this rate. Senpai, you got that up over there. Is Sunny Oh, Senpai, would you like to meditate with me for a bit? That depends. Is your definition of meditating us fighting each other until we both spit up blood? Yep, pretty much. We have it all to ourselves, so it's a good chance to take a moment and refocus. Also says, if I have time, I'd love to have a homemade dish my mom makes. Something nostalgic. Oh, that's so cute. Dale says, a, a great A5 Wagyu beef. Wow, that's <laughs> okay. Um, if I, I already said the burgers thing, but if I could be very specific, I don't know if I shared this story during Tokyo Xanadu. This is a very old thing, so only old school Vibin DGR fans may know this, but there was a diner back in uh, Teaneck, New Jersey, my hometown, um, and I have so many nostalgic moments of going there with my grandmother and my grandfather and my mom and dad and most of my family. It's a it's a diner called Matthews. I feel like we've talked about this before. It might have actually been through Tokyo Zandu. I don't know. It's been we've done a lot of episodes, but it's just an ordinary turkey burger. There's nothing special. It's like an ordinary diner style turkey burger. Like they have the pickle on the side, fries. You can add for like ketchup, mustard. There's nothing really too like crazy about it. And I'm not saying. There aren't better burgers out there, but if we had to go for like the nostalgia factor, it would be that, or just my grandmother's like cooking, cause holy crap, my grandmother could cook, or my mom, either or two. But it would still be a burger, no matter what. It would still for sure be a burger. I I'm boring as Beck. I'm boring as Flip. I'll always go for a burger any day. Both <laughs> said two types of people, and then Bale says, "I mean, can you blame me? It's known to be absolutely amazing. I've never had grade A five uh, wagyu beef." I've always just had normal burgers, beef, turkey, uh, steak. I I've never really had grade A. I don't know. Maybe if I travel, maybe if I one time grow, uh, okay, my dream, if I could grow bigger. I would love to be able to like go to a nice, like authentic spot and have grade A uh, Wagyu beef. Of course, though, considering my messed up ta uh, palate, I don't know if I'd be, it'd either be one of two kinds of things for me, right? Either it'll be the most heavenly burger or I'll be like, oh, well, it was good. Anyway, who's ready for dessert? Like, I don't know how it would be for me. And I don't know how it would be for you guys. Would you guys choose a fancy meal or anything like that? I don't know. Ale says, neither have I. That's why I try it. Well, that's fair. That's fair. Especially if those are our last meals. I wonder if anyone would choose something, like, really wild. Like, I don't know. Uh, What's wild? Donkey intestines or something. I don't know. Like, I'm not saying that you should be eating a donkey. I'm just saying, like, who would choose, like, a really out there food as their last meal? Also says, no, it's actually cool be uh, cool of you because I'm too picky to try something new on the last day before I die. Well, it it's your last thing. Just try something interesting. As long as you don't regret it, I think that's the thing. But I'll, I'll talk more about that later. We've got an emotional moment going on. <clears throat> Strange. Strange. <laughs> I already feel more centered just closing my eyes like this. Yeah. And the deep breaths are really calming, right? 
大切な立ち会いの前には瞑想の時間は必ずとっているんです。イグシマスタイル、always has meditation before an important match。コーセンパイ。コーセンパイ。先輩の目の前の壁は。乗り越えられそうですか。you think you can overcome the wall in front of you。まだ。わからねえな。I。don't know yet。どのくらいの大きさかも、今は見えていないくらいだ。I, I saw the message, I'm about to read in a second. I can't even see how big it is. Oh. Oh. Oh, where are you putting your hand on?、Uh. まだまだ未熟です um, I'm still kind of an experience at this sort of thing. See, this is how messed up my brain is. I'm not gonna say it though. We're just gonna. We're just gonna move up. I'm just gonna move on. いいいいいいかかかかもわららななくて I don't know what I should be saying to you. Sora. Sora. だけど私先輩にはとても感謝しているんです But, I'm grateful to you. 私は私自身の部と向き合うきっかけを you help me find my own martial arts. 壁を乗り越えるきっかけを作ってくれたから Gave me the opportunity to overcome my own wall. That's why I want to help you this time. Let's overcome the wall together and get to Shiori. Thanks, Sora. Why did she think for a second? Thanks, Sora. You really are amazing. Your karate skills, your kindness, everything about you shines like the sun. To the point where next to Toa, you would be best girl. And I don't know why we haven't had any romantic options with her yet. Unless we can't because we see her as a sister or something. Oh, Ko! What? I'm proud to have you as my fellow dojo student? Oh, man. Oh, Flag Crusher Tokisaka strikes again. But I get it. Jokes aside, it is very sweet and emotional, so I shouldn't be that guy. I wouldn't be normally. I'm just being funny. I shouldn't be. I'm sorry. Oh, Senpai. Oh, Senpai. That's why I can't show you the pitiful side of me anymore. I don't know what lies ahead. But I have to stand my ground. I. We've got your back, Ko Senpai. No matter what happens, no matter how big a wall stands in your way. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Sonja, Stoa. Nanto Kabuji Modot de Conetona. We had better do our best tomorrow then. I've got to train with you to get ready to get you ready for the summer competition, too. Oh. Oh. Let's make sure we make it back. <laughs> yes! Aww, even though it's clearly seeing us as brother and sister. Whatever, at least she's done. All right, now I can read chat. Okay, I'm far behind. Uh, Bale says, Rocky Mountain Oysters. Someone will pick it. I'm not that person. That doesn't sound bad. I like seafood. Puzzle says, I've heard duck meat is tender. Uh, and French people eat snails. I try both of them. Oh, actually, I don't know. Ducks are kind of cute. I don't know. Bale says, you don't know what those are. Keep your innocence. Don't look them up. I'm kind of... Curious, is it really bad? Are Rocky Mountain,、uh, Rocky Mountain oysters that bad? But is it just like normal like, seafood oysters, or am I wrong?、Uh, Puzzle says, It's so funny to me seeing Ko is running around to meet everyone around town his last day before battle. I would never do that. Actually,、uh, I, I'm, I'm, I might. It depends. If it was my last moments, I probably would. Puzzle says, The way he said Ani in the voice line, and Emoto. Yeah. Because Ani and Emoto, it's basically familial terms. Like, Emoto, for example, is like sister. Like, it, it's basically Ko saying, I see you as a sibling. So it's just really just crushing my hopes.、Uh, Puzzle says they didn't include that in the text, lol. 
Yeah, because they know people like me are like, oh, well, they think people may not understand Japanese. I've watched enough anime to know what Ani or Aniwe or Emoto or Emoto yo or, uh, you know, things like that. Otosan, Akasan. I, I know some things. I'm not good at it, but I know some things. Vicky, welcome to the stream. Said spoiler, I'm asleep. You'll probably be asleep soon. Oh, well, still, thank you for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Yes, they bad. They're not seafood. What is a Rocky Mountain Oyster? Also says, damn, this is making me more curious. I don't know what a Rocky Mountain Oyster is. Sparring with Sora. Is it really bad? Should I really not look it up? I know we will cover your back. No matter what happens, nothing will stay in our way. Let's do our best. I I'm really curious, but you guys are like telling me I really shouldn't look it up. I want to trust you guys. It's just my curiosity is pissing me off. Oh, the torn sheets. Was it you that fixed them? What a marvelous repair job. I can't even see the seams. It's the least I can do. <laughs> it's the least I can do. Oh, wow, she... Oh. <laughs> After all, I wasn't much use for anything else today. Now, that's not true. Many people took heart from how earnest you were. You did a great job, so rest up. Tomorrow, you need energy to send good thoughts for your mission, okay? Thank you, Sensei. I will. I should really get to rest like the teacher said. I'm glad I can help somehow eat with this body. I really hope you get better. Going on his injury is looking good. It hasn't been two days, a day at most. I can't believe it. Go pay him a visit? Oh, right. I forgot about June. Let's go talk to June real quick. Oh, yeah, he is doing better. Um, Puzzle says, oh, okay, I looked it up. Bale says, if you want to be ruined, then go ahead. Puzzle says, I can see why they think it's bad. Uh, For once, I'm not messing with you. Puzzle says, it actually looked yummy fried until I read what it is, lol. That's not helping me. I think he says, bull, no, no, parta. What? I don't, what? I don't know what that is. Okay, okay, you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll let YouTube get engaged. Unless chat says otherwise, I make this promise to you, YouTube. Unless someone in the YouTube comment section writes it out, I refuse to look it up. Oh, well, too late. Uh, puzzles already said it's genitals. Oh, wait, it's... Wait, Rocky Mountain Oysters are genitals? Like, bull part? Oh, going from what Nikki's saying, too. So it's like bull parts? Oh, oh, I see. Okay. I don't know what it is. Like, I haven't seen it, but chat's telling me what it is. If, if it's what I'm imagining, like, if it's something that... Okay, just just so I, I know I'm on the right track, because I, I still refuse to look it up. But if it's something like what I'm imagining, is it something like, like from Fear Factor, people would be like, all right, we'll give you $50 million if you eat this. Like, it's one of those kinds of things, like eating roaches or crickets, but, like, way nastier. Uh... We'll crop this so YouTube won't know. Oh, well, I'm just going to see what YouTube says. I'm going to let YouTube, like, say this. I'm saying it out loud, so we'll see if YouTube gets involved. Uh, Pulse says, I still can't believe this little guy is the knight. Oh, okay, yeah, it's bull, it's bull parts. Okay, got it. It's bull members, as I like to say. Um. Is there any circumstance where you would eat it, though, is the question. If you were, like, super starving and you had absolutely no choice... And it was the last meal, or if it was like to save your family members, maybe. That would probably be the one thing that would compel me. I'll, I'll be honest with you guys. I wouldn't go out of. I wouldn't go for it. But if it was for like a stupid amount of money or to save like my mom or something, yeah, I wouldn't hesitate. I would take a bite and eat. I'm probably more braver doing that than like jumping off a cliff or something. Nikki says if you boil them, they harden like a hard-boiled egg. Really? Bale says, actually, would be surprised if it wasn't on Fear Factor. I'm pretty sure it probably is. I don't know. But yeah, I, I, to, to put it in perspective for chat and for viewers, I would more likely eat that than jump off, like, a high building or something. Easily. I don't care if I gag. At least I say I did it. But you will not catch me jumping off a freaking building. Not happening. Hey, Ko. You still awake? Yeah. Don't need to rest? 
You might have recovered a bit, but you're not just gonna bounce back right away, you know. <laughs> Maybe. It should take you back about two days to be back to full strength. Puzzle says it legit looks like chicken when fried, so I'd probably eat it without knowing what it is. Yeah, I, I feel like that would be me too. Like, the one time I got tricked into eating what I thought was a lemon head, but was actually cheese covered grapes, if anybody remembers that tale of mine from way back when, which still pisses me off. I, I feel like I would also get pranked into eating it too. And Veil says, if I was at gunpoint, probably sure. I don't know. What would convince you guys to eat a Rocky Mountain oyster? Please don't, uh, don't attack me for saying that. I'm just trying to get you guys engaged. I think that by tomorrow I'll be good to go. Seriously? Just don't overdo it, okay? Pretty much everything is classified, so I can't tell you much, but I hope that I'll have the chance to tell you something soon. Anyway, our priority is the mission tomorrow. Yeah, everything's on the line. Let's make sure we get everything we got. See, I understand not giving June's thing because I haven't really spent much time with June. So there must be something I'm missing. Alright, who's left? I think it's just Asuka and that thing in the classroom. So we're almost done here. Uh, I'm so lame. I look tough. What it came down to it, I just ran. Damn it, I need to do better? I don't care. I mean, yeah, I do care about you, but you're not my friends. You're not the important people. Uh, I should, really should be skimming this because that was just information. I should have read it and I stupidly skipped over it. I see. So doing my best can cheer up other people. Oh, I'm being a cheer squad without even knowing it. Sorry, I was so captivated about just trying to get my friends done that I got information. I didn't even pay attention. I'm so ashamed of myself. And it was Ayato's last one. I like this guy. Oh, the power of cheer. The payoff for his dedication and hard work is the success of others. He has embraced the power of cheer that resides in his heart. Good on you. I like how you stood up to your bullies, too. I ran around town all day and I'm beat, but after looking at the state of the town, it doesn't look like there's much earthquake damage. Maybe my mom and brothers really are safe. Go to bed early? Okay, good. What about you? My darling, I heard she's resting in the student council room. It looks like she had a difficult time. Oh, yeah, okay. I was trying to remember who you are. You're basically Mitsuru's super fan, but here in uh, Tokyo Xanadu. Looks like they had a difficult time. They say super quiet so she can recover. But this time, the others, even the boys, work hard. Maybe they aren't so bad, at least for today. Hey, dudes aren't bad. Huh? If my darling is resting here at school, too. Then tonight, we'll be under one roof. Ah, uh, I don't know what to do with myself. Okay, calm down. We don't need the janitor here. Boys aren't bad, I think. Eh, well, we have our moments, but we're not the worst. Did you see Goro-sensei there, up on the stairs? He seems even more hardcore now. Ugh, he's so dreamy. I go talk to him or something. Anything. Ugh. Oh, Hitomi, I know you're worried and everything, but it's okay. I'll definitely help you out tomorrow. What are you two talking about? I was finally able to contact my family at home, but they told me one of the cats got so scared during the earthquake she ran away. Did they think I'd just forgive them if they apologize? Adults are so... Oh, my sweet Gara sensei you really are cool. Wait, Tommy isn't feeling well. This is the time to get distracted. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's go talk to Asuka and get this done. Uh, oh, we already talked to you guys last time. Yeah, I don't think they have any new information, right? Uh, since I've left, otherwise... Well, like these that make me glad... Oh, wait, no, that's new. Oh, I guess not. Never mind. Here's where I clip what Cheer Guy said for you watch after stream. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. Uh, what she's done with our movie or anything will turn out to be success. I'm so sorry, I shouldn't be skipping over things that give me information. Oh, I'm so glad that Gara sensei is alright. If only Shiori came back too. Good luck tomorrow. Yeah, I hope that Shiori comes back. You know, that friend of yours you cared about. Wow, she's embracing reading for the kids. Okay, this is definitely gonna be information for sure. And then the prince and princess lived happily ever after. The end. Wow, that was really great! Hey, read this one next, please. One at a time, please. Oh, I guess it wasn't information. I'm rounding out the children. You know what would have been funnier? Is if one of the kids was like, But what does it mean when you said that the king ate the queen? He's like, uh, nothing. Don't worry about it. Rounding up the children who can't sleep and reading the books to them. In this way, I can at least be a little useful. 
I can't thank Osaku enough. Oh, I'm surprised there wasn't information. Ugh, listening to this is making me sleepy. Sounds like my audience. You sure are good at reading, lady. Or, okay. Where's Asuka? So she's in the library. Oh, there she is. Alright, Asuka, you're the second to last. Let's do this. Hiragi, there you are. Yes, I was looking for something to read. But I can't seem to concentrate. Well, considering the uh, situation... I bet this is the one that gets, like, the romantic thing, right? Because they've been shipping Ko and Asuka a lot. Mara will be. Tokisaka-kun. You really should get some rest. You can talk to the others first, if you like. But I'm sure you're the most tired of us all. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll go to the gym later. Thanks, Hiragi. It's a bit early, but good night. Yeah, good night. Wait, that's it? We didn't get like an emotional moment? No romance? What the flip was that? Good night, huh? Huh, it's just like that time. I don't get it. Oh, I get it. I get it, I get it, I get it. It was when she tried to, like, restrain me when she went to go and basically do, like, a self-sacrificial thing. I think, I might be mistaken on it, but I think that was back in the Witch of the Missing Castle chapter. But she, like, sealed us and was like, all right, I'm going to fight these things by myself. And if I die, uh, well, it is what it is. Back then, the situation and feelings were completely different, but... It seems like I've changed. Probably thanks to him. I'm really surprised. I would have thought for sure we would have got, like, some romantic moment. Should I head to bed early? Is this game, like, low-key only with me and Shiori? I thought for sure. All right, well, then we're almost done here. I guess we'll end this. Let me. Never mind. All right. It has to be Shiori. Like, I thought. I know I said earlier it couldn't be, but who else can it be? Like, it doesn't look like Shiori's profile, but who else can it be? It has to be Shiori. Right? Wait, there's no one in here. Oh. What is this? Shiori. Yeah, okay, it is Shiori. Oh, I get it. Yeah, it's Shiori, but we're thinking about her as a memory, not like she's actually here. I, I'll... So early in the beginning of this video, I was like, it can't be Shiori. But as I was progressing and looking at the map every now and then, I'm like, but who, what other character really matters to Ko? It has to be Shiori. And then, as we're going in here, I was like, wait, Shiori's not here. And now it's like, oh, it's not really physically Shiori, we're just thinking about Shiori. Whatever. Oh yeah, fine, so we get a romantic moment with Shiori, but not with Asuka or Sora. Or at least Rion or Mitsuki. Flip this game. We don't even get a romance moment with Shio? Come on, man. I would have done with Shio. I would have gone with Shio romantically. Ever since we were kids, she's always been by my side. That didn't change even when stuff started happening with the eclipse. I just took it for granted that she'd always be there. I never considered how precious that time was. That it could end. Oh. That then, only I could be with her. Back then, only I noticed the signs. Back then. Huh? Why am I remembering this now? I have a theory on that, but I'll share it afterwards. Okay, now I'm going crazy. Shiori? Where? Are you there? 
Gento. Was it just my imagination? Could it be... Wait, where did that come from? A letter. Was that there before? I don't think that was... I don't think that was there before. Dear Kochan, remember, folks, before I get everything emotional, the woman who voices Shiori is also the woman that voices Darkness from Konosuba, as well as Alice from Sword Art Online. Yeah, I know her roles. It's crazy, her range. She also voices the mother character in the... That one Isekai one that everyone made a bunch of memes about. The Do You Love Your Mom and her, like, multi-attack strike thingies. I, I can't remember the full... Do you love her mom and her multi-hit attacks or something? Like, her range is crazy. That's all I'm gonna say. So, let's just get emotional here. Dear Kachan. Uh-huh. I can't believe I'm writing you a letter. It's been a while since I did this. I know it's kind of random to start again, but I want to put this down on paper. I also never really plan on giving it to you, so sorry if I write something weird. Of course though, I also know that you won't open this letter because I know I don't want you to read it. I know you won't, you know, go against my wishes and take it upon yourself to read my personal letter to you because you're a good friend. Aww. Damn, I was cute as a kid. Anyway, ever since we were little, we've always been together. Who's the kid in the background, though? I guess he's just not important. Is that... my parents or Shiori's parents? I don't know whose parents there are. They are, excuse me. I have a bad joke, but I'm not going to say it. At home, at school, no matter where it was, you were there. If I was in need, you were by my side. That's how it always was, and how it always will be. You and me, together. Oh, uh, even Kid Ryota. That's what I wish for, anyhow. Oh, I forgot about Ryota. Oh, right. He's the last person we have to bond with. Whoops. Forgot about that. Sorry, Ryota. But sometimes, I get really worried. Like, what if we aren't always together? Like, what if it's some, some just some dream? <laughs> I know it's weird to worry about it. It's not like anyone's ever told me we can't be together. But, Ko-chan, even if that did happen... Oh. The fact that I love you will never change. No matter how apart we might drift, no matter if we die and are reborn, even if the world were to end, I will always love you. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. I will always love you. It's one of the few things I could say with total conviction, because I believe it with all my heart. Anyway, if you ever read this letter, I hope you remember this. I'll always be with you, Ko-chan. 
何が起きても私の真ん中には絶対にそれがあるから。No matter what happens, deep in my soul, I know this to be true. <laughs> 手紙はこれでおしまい。And that's it for this letter. How embarrassing, right? また明日いい日になるといいね。See you tomorrow. I hope it'll be a good day. しおりより。Love, Fury. しおり。Did she just confess her love to me in the most romantic way in letter form? Wow. I, I, I don't know what to say. I don't, really don't know what to say here. Why did she write this? It's like she knew this would happen from the beginning. It kind of looks like I'm about to cry. Thank you. Thank you. God, I, I don't know when you stop talking. I feel like, uh, I know this memes of it. I feel like when I do the translated voices and stuff, I feel like, you know, when you have those like game awards or showcase or stuff, when someone speaks a different language, what happened? Where did I go? Where'd you come from, Cotton Eye Joe? Uh, I, I don't know what I was gonna say, but what happened here? Thank you, Shiori. I feel the same. I will never change. She saved me in more ways than I can ever, ever realize. That never changed. My childhood friends smiled for me in the same way. That's why I have to get her back, no matter what. Wait for me, Yuri. Also, of all the things you said, you said Yandere much. Wow. That Koyu dense. I mean, I, I guess they ship it. I'm surprised we didn't have a moment with Asuka. I thought... I'll be honest. When I later on, I don't know at what moment I thought, but I thought this game would be kind of like Persona, where it's like, oh, I get to choose a romantic interest, or I might have like a low key harem. And honestly, it kind of felt like Ko was building a harem. But then, even if I were to ignore the harem moments, it, it felt for a while that I was constantly pushing Ko and Asuka. And as of late, now it's pushing Ko and Shiori, especially with that. So now I am kind of confused. So, moving on, I guess. There's a gift attached to the letter. A blue bookmark. Breakfasts with Shiori? Why is it called that? I feel like that's supposed to reference something, but I don't get it. Tomorrow I'll take you back no matter what. Wait for me, Shiori. Okay, I have no clue what that uh, achievement's supposed to be. If you know, then let me know. Uh, health plus 250, magic attack plus 90, and a, wow, magic attack plus 90. A bookmark made from bright blue, ugh, bright blue Japanese paper that Shiori cherishes. Oh, but why is it magic based? I have no need for this. I'm not a magic attacker. I should equip it, but I have no need for it. It would actually hurt me equipping it. You know what? Would it be messed up if I gave it to Mitsuki? Hey, Mitsuki, um, so I'm gonna give you this blue bookmark that may or may not have sentimental attachment. You know what? No, I can't. I'm gonna give it to Rion. Rion, hey, so I might be giving you something that Shiori cherishes. You're probably gonna assume that I'm, you know, messed up and really, uh, like, twisted, but hear me out. I got nothing, but you're taking anyway, because it does you better. All right, is that everyone? Okay, the last person. Did I rest up for the day? I know there's something I need to do tonight, but is that all? Resting in the gym will cause the story to proceed. Whoops, I did not want to do that. I do want to go to the first floor, though. Where's Ryota? Where is he? 
Oh, the story is real, I bet. Puzzle says, yeah, kind of messed up. It, it has no use for me. I'm not a magic attacker. You stole it from Shiori, too. You know what? Ko's just messed up because she technically didn't want Ko to read that letter. So, you know what? Screw it. I'm giving it to Ryo. Why is Ryota standing right there? He does know if he steps out there, he's going to get attacked by Greeds. Ryota, he's standing watch again. Should I check up on him? <laughs> Automatic doors. Even if it was addressed to you. I think Ko's just messed up. Well, at least he feels the same way. Ryota. It could be one of those things where Ko could have read the thing. How many times... Okay, I'm not saying I'm tired of it, but I know there's a number of people that are sick of this trope. Where the main protagonist, guy or girl, has like, I don't know, another person's significantly a uh, romantic interest is like, I love you, I've always loved you, be with me, blah, blah, blah. How many times has it where the main uh, protagonist says, oh, yeah, I'm glad that we get to treasure our friendship. I don't know, like, how many people are sick of the, uh, the, my friend made a joke of this, the Fred Jones uh, kind of character. If you get it, because Fred is like, kind of like dense and derpy. When Daphne obviously likes him. I don't know why I'm making a Scooby-Doo reference. Other than it was the best thing I could think of. But I know some of you guys are sick of like, okay, I get it. Do you like me? You don't feel the same way? Just be upfront with it. Then again, I can't read relationship status at all. So who knows? I'm dense as hell. What's up, Ryota? Hey, Ko. Talk's all done? Yeah. For now. You to keep standing watch? Yep, got a little snack that Cheezer brought me, so I'm good to go. Although I am kind of curious. The snack she had, or she gave me, had a bunch of hearts in it. It even said, love you, love you, love you. I don't understand what that meant. So I just ate it anyway. And then out of nowhere, it's revealed that Cheezer is behind a tree. It's just like, tch, tch, tch. damn it. I have to go back to the drawing board. I have to keep an eye on these barrier devices to make sure nothing touches them. Jeez. Hiragi said they'd be fine. It's not like they're super delicate or anything. You're a bigger chicken than I thought. Whoops, I thought that was Ryota. What and what? Well, you might be right. Well, but if you get tired and keel over, it ain't all be for nothing. You got a mission tomorrow, so make sure not to oversleep. That guy would. Well, thanks. We would then return to the school so Ryota could take a break. Wait, I don't have a moment with Ryota? Okay, I know I've been spending moments with Ryota. There must be something I'm missing. Holy moly. Of all the guy characters next to Shio, I know I've been spending time with Ryota, so clearly there's something going on here. But I think that's it. Uh, let's just go to rest. I know there's something I need to do tonight, but was that all? Was there anything? I think we've done anything, right, y'all? Uh, is there anything we would talk to? Okay. We talked to Sora, talked to Toa, talked to Goro, talked to Asuka, talked to June, talked to Yuki. Read Shiori's letter, talked to Mitsuki, talked to Ryo, talked to Shio, talked to... Well, I think I've talked to everybody. So, yeah. I think that's it. Well, I made a separate save, so if I'm missing something, I can just go back. Alright, Ko, how are we spending your last night? Everyone looks pretty wiped out. After all that's happened, I'm not surprised. I'm probably close to my limit, too. But I just feel so on edge. After everything, I should be dead on my feet. Why do I feel sleepy at all? I don't know, the fact that we have this night sky going on. 
I should get some fresh air. You are going to be tired, man. That insomnia is going to be a nightmare. You think about Shiori on the roof? All right, dude, we get it. I just know that dungeon's gonna be a pain, but it's the last dungeon though. We're almost done. Not Shiori, your childhood friend. That's not a voice. Wasn't she absent because of a cold? So then why was she at Akros Tower at the time? I remembered something I was going to talk about earlier. I, I know I've said it already though, but for those jumping in or those new, here's my mentality thinking about it. I think... I know we discussed it already about Shiori being possessed, but I'm really confident on it. I think Shiori is just like Rion. Because even that, that cutscene, when Ko was remembering the past, that like the uh, the big thing in the sky which was done when he was a kid i think whatever the apocalypse thing the twilight apostle or whatever i think it did what the angel did to rion when she was a kid i think it might have possessed shiori but now what i'm worried about though is if it did possess shiori is shiori going to be free and people know that i talked about this before i don't know if i'm right or not because the only other, the only other alternative theory i have is that um, Shiori isn't really Shiori. Maybe she... It, it was a twisted thought. I really hope this game doesn't do it. And I think I might legitimately cry. But I'm thinking like, okay, they're putting up all these flags about Shiori and Ko and all that stuff. And I'm thinking to myself now, messed up as it is, what would be the one thing that would drive us like to despair? And I'm thinking, what if Shiori was never really alive? Or rather Shiori, like all this time? What if she was actually like gone and it was just the entity that took her place all this time waiting i was because I, I, I was like what would be the one thing that would mess co up something fierce probably finding out that the child friend he grew up with and loved was no longer with her i don't want it to be i hope it's like i hope it's like rion where she's just possessed and we can save her because obviously that'd be more ideal because i don't know what this game's gonna do But she's been through the ringer. Yeah, look at all the times she already been suffering something. Except for the hot spring moment. Oh, and, and that moment too, I guess. I, oh, I guess the... Oh, I don't know who that is. I couldn't do anything. Back then, I was helpless. They said Boku. <laughs> my little bad knowledge of Japanese language and literature. I'm pretty confident, chat, YouTube, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but when kids, or rather most uh, males, address themselves, they say boku, which is usually meant for like a boyish means of saying yourself or I. So I think that was Ko back in his past saying, back then I was helpless. <laughs> <sighs> Please tell me. This is a dream. Oh, okay. That's Asuka's voice. Oh, are we going to have a romantic moment with Asuka? If so, then I really don't know where this game's going. You should get some rest. Tomorrow will be pretty rough if you don't. Yeah, I know. Just doesn't feel like night, so I couldn't sleep. Yep, Asuka. Go figure. <laughs> You're pretty sensitive. So to be fair, I'm not much better. <laughs> oh yeah? Pandora's box. Oh man, this is gonna suck. That thing is oh that thing is serious trouble. 
The way it's going, it'll be double the height of the original tower. Wait, the way it's going. Is the tower growing? Ugh. Ever dealt with anything like this, Hiragi? No. This is a first for me. And if I'm honest, it's a bit much for a rookie enforcer. So a veteran could take care of that thing, no prob? That'll be that easy. In a sense, it's not about experience or power. Mentality, that's the deciding factor. Mentality, huh? Also, that wasn't her voice. She's supposed to be more like this. Quieter. I don't know why I'm giving her a much higher, like, tone of it. Hiragi, you're not going to ask me? No, I'm not. That's something you need to solve yourself. Rion scolded you early enough earlier anyway. Normally, I just wipe your memory to solve the problem. You don't sound like you're kidding. Yeah, I am. So why do you have your phone in your hand? Uh, just to check the time. Hypnosis and memory control are only surface deep. What lies deep inside someone's mind isn't so easily reached. Huh. Even so. Maybe you can give it a shot? Wait, what? Does she- Oh, does he want her to erase his memory so that way he's more motivated to do this? It seems I'm afraid. I'm afraid of finding the answer inside of me. Am I doing? Just whining like a brat. Much longer am I gonna let her baby me? Ah, uh, look. The cherry blossoms are about to fall. That was when you and I really met, in a sense. What? Uh, what? No matter how far I pushed you away, you just kept coming back. And you brought others with you. More and more of your amateur friends. I think they're that much of an amateur now. Yeah. The style that I nurtured at Nemesis until now was turned on its head. We met in that underpass, I thought it was a total failure. Uh, well... S sorry about that. I didn't mean it. But now, I think that was for the best. I was so stubborn back then. Pretty immature, to be honest. But 
But with all the trouble here in Morimiya, I changed over time. So I was able to grow in the true meaning of my life. Incident by incident, I finally grew into someone that is truly me. XRC の みんなと。時坂くん、あなたがいてくれたからよ。And it's all thanks to everyone in the XRC and you, 時坂くん。Oh. oh. <laughs> 時坂くんの問題も同じ。それはあなた自身が解決することだわ。It's the same for your problem. You have to solve it yourself. But never forget. I, no, we are always beside you. Let's tell you, I feel like Sora just said that line actually. Sora chan and Shinomiya kun. Mitsuki san ni. Takahata Senpai, Rion san ni Toa Sensei mo. Mitsuki san, Takahata Senpai, Rion san, and Toa ne, Toa Sensei. So shite, Ibuki kun ni, Kohinata kun ni, kitto, Shiori san mo. Ibuki kun, Kohinata kun, and Shiori chan as well. Anata ga, anata dake no kotae o mitsukeru no o mimamotte iru kara. We're all watching over you so that you can find your answer. Hiroki. Wow. I get it now. It's not that I can't sleep. It's just, if I go to sleep, then tomorrow will come. And once tomorrow comes, everything will be clear. That terrifies me. But the sun will always rise no matter how dark it is. Everyone's given me the courage to move forward. Thanks, Hiragi. Thanks, I think I'll finally be able to get some sleep because of you. <laughs> You're welcome. It's such a good moment. Tokisaka-kun. Tomorrow. Tokisaka-kun ka. Uh-huh. I'm still using your last name. We've known each other for three months, but still... Has it been three months? How it's been long. It's a long three months. Now that you mention it, it is a little weird. You want to switch the first names? Yeah, uh, yeah. I'm already calling all the girls by theirs. Alright. Asuka it is. How's that? And Ko. What? <laughs> and better? So, so ne, go. Let me try again. Oh. What? What? Is it that bad a name? Just say my name. What? <laughs> what reaction was that? Oh. Oh, we can't be having this bromance trip and flag. That's so shameless. We just had a moment with the whole, like, Shiori confessing her love. And now you got Asuka here? This game needs to make up its mind. Am I being shipped with with Asuka? Or am I being shipped with Shiori? Which one? Because clearly it's not any of the other girls that I'm thinking of. So you clearly have a direction in mind. Make up your mind. 
I don't think I've ever seen Asuka, or would have ever imagined Asuka doing that animation. That is surprisingly really cute and refreshing. Uh, hold on. Uh. Don't tell me you're embarrassed. Maybe. It's normal to call close friends by that first name. With a guy, it feels different. That's a good hearty laugh right there. I didn't even have to do it. Oh, come on. <laughs> sorry, sorry. But who cares what we call each other, right? We can just stay as is if you want. No, I mean, you can call me by my first name if you like. I kind of liked it. Game! Which one? Is it Shiori or Asuka? See, it's not that hard saying their first names. Wait, you called Shiori by her for. Oh, well, right. Asuka's the one that's embarrassed. Never mind. I don't know why, for some dumb reason, I thought it was Ko. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Anyway, moving on. Tomorrow's the day. I'll be counting on you, Tokisaka-kun. Wow, so you're not going with the first name thing, huh? Alright, whatever. Yeah, me too. Asuka. Asuka. I don't know, it was still a really sweet, touching moment. I really do like it. It was really cute. It kind of jumped Asuka favorability in my heart. But at the same time, I still just don't get it. Asuka Khan Amor. Forge of Breakable Bond Asuka. But I did get one with Rion? Whoa, I forgot it's doing this weird trippy thing. July 8th? Wait, it still says the 8th. Wait, that's, yesterday was the 8th. It's still the 8th? Does time stop? Time stop. It's still the 8th. Into the battle van. We're ready to kick some ass. Oh, mission directive? Alright. Alright, please allow me to. Actually, you know what? Considering the time of the vid, maybe we should stop it here. Because I'm betting after this cutscene, we're just gonna go straight to it. Eh, well, I mean, odds are we'll probably end this and then I want I should actually save so that way I don't have to do it. I don't know, because then I have to do that cutscene again. And eh, never mind, we'll just let this play out really quickly. I'll just go a little bit over, it's fine. Sorry, YouTube. Alright, please allow me to explain the plan for today's mission. First, the Angricum, the Takahane group, and Blaze will make up the initial approach on Pandora. While they are engaging, the Dark Angels will advance from the left and right flanks. Next, the Seal Knights of Orden and the Self Defense Forces Zero Battalion Aegis will go in. Once the path has cleared a bit, the XRC members will then push through the using the armored vehicle. And then we'll destroy Pandora and stop the culprit behind all this. 
<laughs> なるほど。今日にもかなってやがるな。I didn't think I'd be tearing up my throat this episode. <clears throat> A f i t t i n g strategy. Takabane Gumi. I was a voice. Show Chishtaze. Takahane group will see this through to the end. Heh. Hade ni areso da shi. Minagi te kuru jane ka. Yeah. You won't just see it through. We'll smash you through. Blaze mo liokai da. Blaze is gonna light this party up. I would like to request that Goro Sensei operate the vehicle. It'll have an active barrier spell, so it should prove a sufficient battering ram. Alright, I'll be the designated driver for this mission and get you to the tower. To my Aegis comrades, I wish you luck. Yes, sir! We will fulfill our mission as members of the Zero Battalion! How are you feeling, Jun? I'll manage. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hold back here. As a seal knight, I swear to give it my all. Oh. Oh. You got some guts, kid. Still can't go over the fact that. Sorry, puzzles. I know you said it earlier, but yep, this little kid is literally one of the most powerful people in this game so far. It's astounding. <laughs> it gives me hope to hear it. As a former bloodhound, I'll have to at least equal your resolve, Knight. Kyoka-san. Kyoka-san. <laughs> Yoroshiku-tanomu, Kyoka-kumu. <laughs> yes, we all display such courage. Morimiya-no, Tokyo-no, Soshite Nihon-no Kobo, Kono Issen ni ari. The fate of Morimiya. The fate of Tokyo. No, all Japan lies with this battle. Best of luck, everyone. <gasps> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. And to the members of the XRC, your role is pivotal to our success. Be sure to rest well prior to the mission so that you'll be at 100%. Hi. Yes, sir. Going down, y'all. Hope I'll at least be able to go to the towns. I'll do it off camera if I can. I want to go to the towns and stock up on stuff because I feel like I'm going to need it. This is our ride. This is our ride. It's just a mom van. It's bulletproof or something, right? <laughs> something like that. It's a special order. Its max speed is pretty high, so we should be able to force our way through. I wish I could help drive, but I can't reach the gas pedals. Sorry, done enough, Toane. You are a huge help coming with our plan of attack. Hmm. Going through thousands of strategic options to determine the most effective use of our forces. Out a head on you for the General Staff Office of the SDO. <laughs> Don't tease me like that, Saiki Sensei. I've already done it for the American military a couple years ago. Goro Sensei, please don't poach her from the school. Uh huh. Pretty bold for a guy whose true identity got outed. Goro Sensei, I'm going to go to the school. Oh, Sensei, 
counting on you. XRC no. As the vice advisor to the XRC. <laughs> mm. Wasn't expecting a title like that. But, might as well tag along with this club activity of yours to the end. The very end. The mission will begin at noon. We have a little bit of time still. Go around town and make sure you've taken every and taken care of everything you need to. Oh, okay. We actually are going to town. Oh, all right. All right. Uh, all right. Everyone, this might be the last free time we have as the XRC. Make sure you don't have any regrets. Roger that. Feels like the last save point before heading into the final dungeon of the game. Might be good to warm up and get some last minute stretches in. <laughs> Just be careful, everyone. I'll be in the XRC club room doing some file checks on the mission plan. Got it. Oh. So that means that this is definitely it, right? Like, last chance for no return. Obtain Goro's personal clothes and battle uniform. How? Uh, don't worry about it. The destination's Pandora and residential districts have been added. Selecting Pandora will make the town unavailable from that point on. Yep, okay. So this is the point of no return. If we're going to do any free exploration, which I think I might end up doing off camera... Then, once we get to Pandora, it's donezo. Shop functions will also be unavailable, and any other things left undone will remain that way. So please be careful. Like your party members? Um... Uh, no! I guess it really doesn't probably matter. The Box of Disaster, Pandora. Oh, front of page. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna do off-camera, folks. Ooh, I got information. Wait. No, I didn't. Oh, I got my little chibi icon. Okay. And then Goro got... What did Goro get? He didn't get anything. If he got something, I don't know the difference. But here's what I'm going to do. Uh, here's what I'm thinking off camera. Off camera, uh, I think I'm going to run through the areas and explore the spots. Um, because I, I really thought that this episode... Well, I figured this episode was going to be more just like the final bonding thing. I didn't think it was going to allow me to like go to town uh so to speak as much so here's what i'm thinking i'm like i said i'm gonna go off camera i'm gonna just explore all the towns and everything um residential area what's the residential area though i don't know what the residential area is so i think when i okay, okay let, let me let me start over i'm gonna do the memorial park haraicho nanahoshi mall brick alley the shrine, the street, the square, and the school. I'm gonna do all of these off camera. If there's any new thing, I'll write a note of it and I'll give you guys like the explanation during the beginning of next week's episode. But next episode, I think it's gonna go down. We'll do the residential area. I don't know what that is. And then we're doing it, the final dungeon. I feel like it's better doing that instead of going around because I don't know if there's gonna be any new things because honestly, what am I going to do to prepare? All I'm really going to do, honestly, is just run around, talk to people, see if there's new information. I might do some dungeons off camera to farm money. If anything, the one thing I really do want to do, I don't know if I will, but the thing I do want to do is I do want to go to Horaicho and do the arcade. Because I know there's some uh, accessories I do want to get. And I could farm to get some better equipment and stuff. But like I said, if there's any significant things, I'm going to write it down in my journal and then I'll tell you guys. So... Thank you all for tuning in. This episode was a little bit longer than normal, but considering all the emotional stuff and considering all the things that I was just... Again, seriously. Thank you. Shout out to Puzzles. The Objectable Puzzle for this. Not to single out and not to say I'm not grateful for all of you guys tuning in, but Puzzles, you threw me for a loop with that one. I, I cannot express how grateful I am to you. As well as all you viewers tuning in. And YouTube, again, if I had the ability to chat overlay, or once I get a setup, which I am saving up for, I really am trying to make it happen this summer, and I really, really am hopeful, so 
I really want to be able to just get more people to intuit. Not that I don't mind reading it, but I want you guys to be a part of it. But again, I'm done. You already know my plan. So next episode, it's going down the residential area, wherever that is. And then the final dungeon. It's about to be done, y'all. Although we all know it's going to be a sucky dungeon. It's going to be the worst dungeon. We already know it. So get ready. We're truly at the end game. So I will see you all in the next episode. It is about to go down.